Hey, hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. All right guys, Sam's Club has some new Tattoo Chef products, so we picked them up. We previously brought you reviews for the Pad Thai and the Cheeseburger Bowl, and now today we are rounding it out with the third and final one. It is the Tattoo Chef Huevos Rancheros Bowl, cage-free scrambled eggs and black beans layered in with a corn tortilla, ranchero sauce, salsa verde, and topped with cotija cheese. Four 10 ounce bowls for $12.98. It is gluten-free and vegetarian. Now that all sounds really good. And Tattoo Chef is very fascinating because if you guys don't know, they have a very passionate following, mainly for their stock price, but us, we care about their food. Yes, exactly. Does it taste good? Because we don't care how the stock is doing. If the food doesn't taste good, eh. And so guys, we have a Tattoo Chef playlist. We've reviewed just about all their products, and this one is something new, and I was super excited about because mm -hmm. I love uh, huevos rancheros. Mm -hmm. Well, and I love a good breakfast bowl, you know, all in one, so you don't have to cook and stuff like that. And we previously reviewed their breakfast scramble bowl kind of thing with plant-based sausage. I liked that. I thought that, that was pretty good. You didn't love it so much, but hey, they did good on that one. So I'm hoping that this one does good also. So guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. Oh, okay. So underneath of here is your eggs and black beans. Then you have your tortilla, and then you have like a little bit of salsa kind of stuff up here. I wish we got some uh, sauce on the side. Yeah, me too, because uh, quite honestly, the underneath of this looks very, very dry. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. Hey guys, welcome back. Our rating system, thumbs up we buy it again, thumbs down we would not. So for me, this is a big thumbs down. Talk about a disappointment. It usually happens with Tattoo Chef because something you're excited about, you're not gonna like, and something you're not excited about, you're gonna like. And that's what happened here because this thing, there's so many things wrong with this. Number one, it needs seasoning. It's just very, very bland. Number two, there's barely any egg in it. Yeah, the cover makes it look like it is like 90% egg, right? Yeah, because there's a lot of black beans in this. And so when I was eating it, I was, I was actually having to search for egg. Mm -hmm. So that really sucks. And number three, not enough sauce, man, because there was barely any in there and it was very dry and I was just, look, if you're gonna like buy this, you're gonna have to add some salt and pepper, your own sauce, and maybe even uh, make your own egg and just throw it in there. So big thumbs down. Wow. Okay, and I would just like to point out that there will be people that will say, well, that's fine, you know, jazz it up a little bit. We're already paying 13 freaking dollars for four bowls of this, so. That's a lot of money. Jazzing it up is gonna cost you even more money. So for me, this is a thumbs down. I was mucho, mucho disappointed in this Huevos Rancheros. This thing, I thought of all of the items that we bought, this was going to be the one that I would absolutely love. And this was really the only one that I wanted to buy. And I was like, well, I guess we'll try the others. Wow, she let me down. She let me down so hard that she just dropped me. This thing, number one, the amount of black beans is just like overwhelming. There's so many and I like black beans, but these are also the driest black beans known to man. There is yeah. just, no, there's no moisture in them at all. Do you see that? It's all black bean in there, man. Yes, everything black that you see, that's not the bottom of the bowl, that's black beans. So that was super disappointing. And also I'm looking and it says ranchero sauce. Um, where? Like there was just no sauce in this thing at all. Like on top, we could see a red sauce, but whenever it's on top of the tortilla, it seemed to soak into the tortilla, but the tortilla itself, despite that happening, was super, super dry. So I at first had tasted the bottom layer without the tortilla, and that was the eggs, the cheese, and the beans, super bland, nothing to it, and also super dry. I think the sauce should have come on the side. I think so too, or hey, just actually put some sauce in here because there was almost none. But then whenever you add in the tortilla and you're trying to eat that with it also, it gets like 10 times drier. 
And even though you could see red sauce on the tortilla, it didn't taste of anything. And it was also dried on top of it too. The whole thing where like they just went wrong at every single turn on this thing. And I'm just like, who okayed this? <laughs> because it is bland. There's no seasoning at all. There's no sauce at all. Everything is dry. I think right now this dog is what, at $19 or something yeah. like that? It's gonna go down. It's gonna go down to five bucks. <laughs> to sum it up guys, thumbs down, thumbs down. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.